Apples are one of the most popular fruits in Ireland and they grow pretty well here too. Kitty's off to Tipperary to meet renowned apple grower, Contras. Irish apples have been grown commercially for over a century and currently there are three main types produced here in Ireland. Dessert, culinary and cider apples. We also produce apples for fruit juices which are sold into the retail and food services sector in Ireland and internationally. But Irish grown apples are regrettably vastly outnumbered by the imported apples which dominate the home market. Thankfully, established apple growers like McCann's are planting new orchards like this one in County Loud, which was recently planted in order to increase the supply of homegrown apples and to stimulate demand for them. The climate in Ireland is very suitable for growing certain varieties of apples, such as areas along the east coast and also inland in Kilkenny and in Tipperary, where I've come to meet apple grower Con Trass. Con's family grew apples in Holland since the 1800s. But in the 1960s, Con's parents moved to Tipperary, bringing their expertise with them. So quite an operation on a commercial level then. Yeah, I suppose apples are only in season for two, three months of the year. August, September, October is when we harvest in Ireland and, and that's, your, that's your fresh apple season. And all the rest of the time, they're, they're, they must be coming from storage or sometimes they're coming from the Southern Hemisphere because their harvest season is the opposite of ours. It's February and March. And we do import an awful lot of apples, a lot of apples yeah, <laughs> in this yeah, country, yeah, yeah, yeah. over about 95 percent. We used to say about 5 percent, but it's actually after dipping below that in the last couple of years, so it's probably about 3 percent of what's sold in the supermarkets and in the general market is, is Irish produced apple and the rest is imported. Which it seems as a country, it's a, one of the crops we produce the best. What's the barriers to, to people? Well, you know, the French just flooded Ireland with, with Golden Delicious and you know and people wanted the newest thing which was the Golden Delicious at the time and that, that was the I suppose the start of people accepting imports if you know what I mean instead of instead of Irish and people kind of forgot about Irish then after a while and it's only in the last two or three years I suppose with the kind of environmental awareness and just the general local food awareness that people are looking in a much bigger way for Irish again. Mm -hmm. 